We are following breaking news in Brooklyn, very distressing, a big subway shooting in Sunset Park uh, section of Brooklyn. Robert Moses is there. He's on the phone with us right now. Robert, what can you tell us? Rosanna, we're on our way to the scene. I just got off the phone with a detective who is still trying to piece together what happened, but preliminarily, and again, I want to stress preliminarily, what, what he is hearing is that multiple people have been shot and separately some sort of device, what he described as a bomb, also went off uh, at the 36th Street station in Sunset Park. To give you a sense, it's a very busy area of the city and multiple subway lines, uh, just to name a few. B we're, B we're looking Q, right, go, Robert, go while, through there. Robert, while you're talking, we're looking at the scene right now. We do have some pictures, and we see a lot of uh, police cars and ambulances right there. Do we know... How many people have been wounded? Uh, I was told multiple casualties. Uh, we're, we're hearing reports that potentially six people have been shot. Um, and, and I, I want to caution you, you'll hear the word casualty. That doesn't necessarily mean uh, people have died. The, the detective that I was speaking with didn't have that cleared up yet. So we don't know if they, they were uh, injured or how severe they were injured or, uh, heaven forbid, if anyone has died in this uh, I'm, I'm trying to piece together uh, things as I'm going uh, to the scene as well. So, Robert, uh, Robert, this happened in the middle of rush hour this morning? Correct. 36th Street Station. Uh, we don't know. Again, I'm going to say we don't know uh, some things, but we don't know if it was actually in the train or in the station. Uh, we heard from a witness, actually, uh, on, on Twitter, who was... Um, entering the the station and he saw uh what what he described as a as a young man uh coming up with uh who had been bloodied oh, so geez. we don't know if that person had been shot or had been hit by uh shrapnel from whatever device this is um we are near the uh the, the hugh carey tunnel and you know as, as we're making our way toward the scene we're hearing you can probably hear in the background sirens from uh, police who are descending on this scene. This will be a, a massive scene, as you can see from the pictures that, that, that we've been showing. Uh, Roseanne, I just want to uh, check my phone to see if I have any, any other information. I'll so tell you, you Robert, uh, this, I don't know what's going on in this city, but for the last few months, it has been one catastrophe after another. This is incredible that this is going on. While, you know, we, we fought with <laughs> Albany to get bail reform, to get guns off the streets, and this is happening on a day like today. It just well, well, and and Rosanna, as you well know, the subway system is is like the circulatory system for the human body. It it is the it is the the pulse of this city. And as people are coming back, uh, you know, we know that people are not working uh, five days a week in the office anymore. And, and city officials want people to come back. Well, in order to get them to come back, they have to be comfortable riding mass transit. And uh, th so far, that just has not been the case. The crime in transit has been up. And uh, obviously, what, what is unfolding today does nothing to help that. You're absolutely right. Uh, Robert Moses, thank you so much. When you get some more information, please let us know. Um, we'll come to you right away. We appreciate that.